if you had to spend just, you know, I'd say two hours or so having a drink with somebody that you, you know, have have never met before, like, who would it be? Who would I like to have a drink with? Hmm. That's a tough one. I mean, can I give you my top, my top ten? That'd be top, great. Yeah. I mean, because, you know, is it too pretentious? I'll start with Proust. I'd love to have had a drink with Proust, although I'm not sure how much he drank in the period in which he was writing. Um, Baudelaire would have been interesting. Of course, I don't speak French, so both of those would have been a little difficult. Um, uh, Beethoven, of course. Bach, I would have loved to ask him some really important questions about tempos. Um, <laughs> so that I could then win all the arguments when I came back from my drink. Uh, let's see. Jack Kerouac, because he really knew how to drink. Um, Let's say, uh, I'm not sure Joyce was that fun to drink with, but why not? I'm sure it would have been interesting in one way or another. Uh, you know, it's, a lot of it is uh, T.S. Eliot I would have been interested, although he, maybe Pound would have been crazier. Uh, what else to drink with? Not that interested in Dickens. Probably not Flaubert either. Um, Balzac would have been interesting. Apparently he was quite a character to have a drink with. Just generally, the way he lived life was maybe in its disorganization not that different from mine. Is that ten? Well, it's a bunch. It's a bunch. <laughs> yeah. so maybe a party. You could have a it's party, a party yeah, with all of them. them. But then they would all be arguing or it would be ruined if you put them all together. <laughs> <laughs>